Hello everyone, I'm Gremlin, and this is Vampire Survivors. It's a really cool game that came out several months ago. I just finally got around to trying it, and I will say I'm addicted. Another cool thing is that it was just added to Xbox Game Pass, and so if you have Game Pass, you can play for free. Uh, and on Steam, I currently have the PC version. It's like $6. So it's not an expensive game, and I've already got about eight hours of gameplay, and so I think it's well worth it. Really cool feature that I'm not sure is on Game Pass, but it is on the PC version, is you can have a Twitch integration that will allow your viewers to help or hinder your progress. That has been really awesome for me uh, to get familiar with different abilities in game, and it also helps you to unlock stuff. So while I haven't actually beat a map with the integration active, it's helped me to unlock things, and um, it's just a fun way to get introduced to a lot of the stuff with the game. Some really important abilities I think for early on is getting this one. Surviving 10 minutes will unlock this ability that it's like an AOE damage that kind of like sprays. Another really good one to get started was garlic. And so a cool thing about the Twitch integration is that your viewers can spawn different additional light sources. And so this will give you a chance to get floor chickens and so that will in turn unlock the garlic a little bit easier for you um and then if you go back if you destroy 20 light sources like again uh, if they give you the additional light sources then you can unlock the fire wand pretty easily so those are really good ones to have in your arsenal and then as you progress you could get things like if you find the attract orb from the light source you will unlock the vacuum another really good ability that i use with my aoe style build that helps you to to, to capture the gems from a, a, a further distance which is pretty nice um, we'll go back to the collection here and so we'll talk about some of the drops so like this is what I was talking about before experience gems increase your XP which in turn allow you to get different abilities to progress like you can max out these different things at level 8 and then um, eventually there's things called evolutions and so say for example you um you upgrade your armor once it will allow you to evolve other things. Then we go back to things like the treasure chest. This you get from killing bosses or there's enemies with this like blue glow around them. And those will give you a, a free boost for one of your abilities. Or if, if you get a rare one, you can get three to five boosts plus a ton of gold. So really helpful. If you see any of this stuff drop, just go for it. Like this one will freeze people in place. This one allows you to breathe fire. Um, this one will destroy all the enemies in sight. So anyways, yeah, if, you, if you're playing on Twitch and you get the extra light sources, this will give you a chance to get a lot of these um, way easier. Um, so for me to survive my first two wins to get to 30 minutes, I went for the water, the, the pichon, the Bible, and the garlic so the garlic and the bible create like a protective barrier around you and so i would rather go for those two instead of leveling up like my armor for example and then these do a ton of aoe damage all of these things have pros to them and so you just kind of play with this stuff and see what works best for you uh, in the beginning you can get away with any of this stuff and so i would rather instead of like leveling up or having every weapon uh, I would rather focus on a couple of them and level them to the max. And so we'll go back to characters. I think you only start with Antonio and then you get all these different ones that you can unlock with gold as you progress. So just things to keep in mind. Antonio is good to start with because it's a pretty well balanced character and they have a decent amount of health. And so you just kind of play and unlock these as you progress. I heard Cavallo and Mortasio are the best. I believe the two wins that I had were with Gennaro and Cavallo. And so, yeah, it's just kind of a trial and error. Find the ones that work best with your play style. Uh, we'll go down here to power up. So cool thing is you could refund these at any time. I personally started with Might, Max Health, Recovery, and Magnet, but I'm probably going to refund this and redo these. And so this is just something uh, for you to play with as well. These are the things that have worked for me. And I hope this was enough to at least get you started. Let me know in the comments below if you have any questions or suggestions on things that we could do for future videos. And be sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the content. Uh, so yeah, thanks again for watching and have a great rest of your day.